Uh, this is an application problem involving the Pythagorean theorem. Uh, it involves a baseball field. Uh, as it says there, in baseball, the infield is a square. Uh, a square, of course, has uh, four congruent sides. Uh, in other words, <clears throat> the, it is the same distance uh, from first to second base as it is from home plate to first base. Uh, so it's 90 feet on all four sides. Uh, the catcher, who is right here behind home plate. <clears throat> so the catcher is going to throw the ball to second base uh, if a runner is trying to steal. And my question is, how far does that catcher have to throw the baseball? Uh, from home plate to second base in order to get the runner out. Well, uh, what we have here, uh, since a baseball diamond is actually a square, I know I have a right angle right there in that corner, uh, which makes my hypotenuse uh, basically going from second base to home plate. Uh, I can, since I have a right triangle here, I can apply the Pythagorean theorem which just says that a squared plus b squared equals c squared. Both my a and my b value are 90, so I can take 90 squared plus 90 squared equals c squared. Uh, 90 squared is actually 8,100. So I have 8,100 plus 8,100 uh, equals c squared. Add those two numbers together. Uh, that's 16,200. And take the square root. And whatever number you get for the square root of 16,200, uh, that's actually going to be the distance that you have to throw. Uh, it doesn't work out evenly. It's actually a decimal. It's 127.279. Um, or in exact form, it's 90 times the square root of 2. So a catcher has to throw the ball 90 times the square root of 2 feet, or about 127 feet.